me little sugar buggers, welcome back to the channel for a brand new mod review. So the other day you guys, I was looking on a Tumblr and I came across this career pack that has over 80 freaking careers, which literally sounds insane to me. I don't know why you would need 80 careers, but honestly, I am always looking for new ways for my sims to earn some money and of course add a little variety to the game. Also, side note, um, I am a little hoarse because I finally met up with my best friend after so many months and we were screaming and we were excited and yada yada freaking yada yada and like now my voice is like <laughs> gone, you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, right now we are with my Sims, um, Kim and her soon-to-be boyfriend, Greg. Uh, she's cooking up a little garden salad while he is enjoying the movie, and she absolutely loves the way the counters are placed because she can kind of like watch while she's cooking, which is awesome. Before Greg and Kim enjoyed their garden salad, I did want Kim to go and check her local job listings just to see what she could potentially find. The one thing I absolutely love about this career pack is that it kind of falls under one category so that you don't have have 80 different job listings so you will see Barbie's careers as an option and I know what you're thinking Jen Barbie's careers I know I thought the same thing too when I saw it I was like that's a little weird but um it's actually really 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 cool despite the fact that it's named Barbie's careers since Barbie's introduction in 1959 the doll has been portrayed with many different careers now you can play through some of her most famous careers and experience a bit of everything or stick with one role Barbie has more than 180 in inspirational careers. Ever since the year 2011, she's introduced a career that has been underrepresented by women. Some of these careers include computer engineer, architect, entrepreneur, and film producer. So even though there is some history with this career pack, obviously both genders can apply. You don't have to be female. You don't need to be male. Um, and there is a bunch, and I mean a bunch of different options. So the first thing you are going to notice is it's going to kind of kick off like as a job agency. So you go you find out what you like and then um, once you receive your promotion then you'll be able to you'll be able to select what path you would like to get into there are a total of 10 to pick from the first one is the arts branch where you will become an artist and in this particular career path there are so many different varying art careers it isn't just one that you kind of like level up to so I don't know how many specifically but I think each one um, can have like up to 10 different job titles I suppose so you'll notice here you'll earn 120 no 201 dollars which is insane um it's normal nine to five which is pretty awesome you'll have like sundays and fridays off the next one is business branch where you where you will become a business executive the pay is only 180 dollars but i say only because that's actually still very freaking generous um this next one here is the education branch so you will become a student teacher which is only available at the moment um in discover university which i am just now dabbling into and I absolutely love the education career. Granted, you're not going to have all of the little like props and whatever that come with that pack. Um, but, you know, if you wanted to, if you wanted your sim to have that title, um, they can become a student teacher at $35 an hour. The medicine branch, your sim will become a dentist. Uh, the military, you'll become a army medic, which is actually really cool. The miscellaneous one, um, your sim will actually join as a beauty pageant contestant for 68 simoleons. Then you can be become a um, ambassador in the political branch, a lifeguard in the public service branch, which actually I had Greg kind of dabble into in each job or promotion, you'll be given a different title. So you'll be like, firefighter, policeman, lifeguard, all sorts of types of things. And you do actually earn um, stipends or bonuses as you get um, promoted. So the next one is science and engineering, where you will become a Sea World trainer. And then the last one is a tour guide in the transportation branch. Side note, I do apologize if you hear uh, Crixus in the background. He sounds kind of like a dying walrus right now. I have no idea what is going on in that three-year-old's head. But you know what? I'm not going to stop and ask questions. So for Kim, I I know she is a very ambitious sim. She wants to make the simoleons, the fetias, the dinero. Um, so I'm kind of thinking maybe her becoming a dentist because it's very important for her smile to be in tip top shape is definitely the move. Now, she will be earning $130 an hour. So it's not like the highest paying job, but I'm actually really excited to see what other um, jobs are in the medical branch or the medicine branch. So that's the one that we are going to choose. Now, she will be, oh my goodness. So immediately she actually 
actually earns $143 an hour versus the initial $130, which is pretty cool. Um, she will be starting work in 18 hours, and she does have a promotion task, quite a few of them actually. So she needs to reach level 5 in the charisma skill and level 5 in the wellness skill. So I wasn't expecting to have promotion tasks included, but that's actually really nice. I like that. And she has earned a following bonus of $1,300 simoleons for just signing up for the gig. So unfortunately there is one thing that I found with this mod that kind of irks me a little bit and I don't know what I can do to fix it. So for instance earlier I actually had Greg um, join the I think it was like public I don't know if it was public servants or public service career or whatever it was where he becomes like a lifeguard and like a firefighter and all that stuff. Um, so I actually had him quit his job so that I could try to rejoin the uh, agency to pick something different and unfortunately for me um, the only option I now have is to continue in the public service branch now I don't know why that is like I don't know how I can make it so Greg can go back to the beginning so he can pick a different career path so I, the way that I see it this is the only downfall um, to the mod itself is that once you've kind of picked a career path unless there's a way to fix it that I'm not aware of um, you're kind of SOL, like really you are. So as you can see, he's going to become a lifeguard. If I was to promote him, um, the next thing he would be is a firefighter. He has to reach level five of the charisma skill, level six of the fitness. Um, the one after that is police officer, where he will start learning his writing skills. So this is actually a really fun way to build skills because there's a whole bunch of different ones that your sim needs to work on. Um, after police officer, he would be a Canadian Mountie. Um, did he end up actually earning less money? Ooh, interesting. So the, uh, the job pay even changes a little bit. So for this one, it's logic skill. Let's just see if we can cap it out. I think that's it. So the um, tip top of the, um, what is it called? Public services uh, career is Canadian Mountie. So there's only a few in that one. Um, so for Kim, I wanted her to go to work naturally just so we could see what a normal work day would look like. But um, I'm a little bummed. I'm a little bummed, you guys, that once you selected a path, it's kind of hard or impossible to change it. Good morning, you guys. So it is Kim's very first day as a dentist, and she should be heading to work in about three hours or so. But first, of course, she's got to have some coffee to wake her up. Have her in this cute little uniform. It did not come with the mod. Um, it's actually just from Cats and Dogs. It's literally like a veterinary outfit, but I thought it also was very fitting for like being a dentist and all that jazz. Um, so she has completed all of her tasks to get a promotion. Granted, I don't foresee her getting one the very first day, but it could happen. I'm very optimistic. Um, and then and then also we have Greg uh, leaving to work in about three two, one. While at work, you still have a few different options. For instance, you can leave early, work hard, take it easy, socialize with co-workers, and there isn't anything different for the other career paths, but you can still kind of have somewhat of a sense of control while your sim is away. So I'm going to have both of them um, work really hard. Obviously, Greg has not <laughs> worked on his skill or his promotion requirements, but, um, you know, Kim definitely has. She is an overachiever after all, so I'm not really, I'm not really surprised. Both of our sims are home sweet home after a very tense day at work. I love how Kim is just staring at Greg's ham and cheese sandwich like, dude, stop being a pig. Give me a bite. And he's like, no, my sandwich, bitch. Go get your own. Kim is very close to her promotion. She did amazing today. She actually earned almost 1,200 simoleons, whereas uh, Greg, he only earned about eight. So it is a very, very, very hefty paycheck. Like, I can't even believe how much they get paid um so i did notice she does want to get a promotion so we're gonna play around a little bit and we're gonna see what other um job titles are in the medicine branch so leveling up to the next one um you can become an eye doctor and once you become an eye doctor you will receive a 14 
$100 bonus. The next promotion is nurse. And after nurse, you can become a pediatrician. And then you can become a doctor. And if this is a, oh wait, and a surgeon, holy crap. Um, and a veterinarian and, I'm just kidding, really? No, so this one actually has seven different careers. Whereas um, Greg's here, I feel like he only has like, four different careers. So each one, each career path is definitely a little bit different and obviously each one um, kind of varies in price. So I do find it a little weird that you would have to like get promotions to try different jobs out. That kind of feels a little a little off to me. Um, so I definitely suggest like if there's a particular title that you want your sim to have, cheat it. Use UI cheats if you don't want to install NCC Command Center. That way you can go and kind of like play around and test the individual flavors out. The only downfall, like I said, earlier is the fact that if I wanted my sim to for instance quit a job right we'll do this I'll show you in real time how this does not work um and I wanted her to go and maybe like try something different um I can't which is really stupid it sucks because I think she's gonna get um she's gonna get grandfathered in to the job that she had last which really stinks I don't know if there's a way um, for midnight uh, midnight tech to change this but as you guys can see here she is right back at it again the medical branch unless unless it's somewhere in here and I'm just not seeing it but honestly y'all other than that I really like the ability to have my sim um, try out different titles I love that there are so many jobs to choose from the pay is different the promotion requirements are you know also very different and there's just a lot to do honestly you guys if it wasn't for the fact that when my sim quits they can't try out a brand new career altogether this mod would be a grand slam but I don't think this little fluke completely takes it off the table there might be a way to fix it that I'm not aware of it if you guys know the solution to this type of an issue, let me know in the comments down below. Before we wrap up this review, I did want to pop on to Midnight Tech Simbler just to tell you guys some more information about this career pack. So it is a huge career pack based on Barbie's careers through the years. With more than 200 careers on her resume, Barbie continues to take on aspirational and culturally relevant roles. She recognizes careers in which women are traditionally underrepresented to show girls that they can be any Thing and to encourage discovery and exploration through play. Now you can play through her careers. You don't have to be a Barbie fan to play as only the career descriptions mention her. There are also some little Barbie facts in there too. Oh, that's actually really cool. I was a huge Barbie fan as a kid so I mean, you know, I'm, I'm totally about that life but obviously when you're playing The Sims you know, I like to keep it strictly Sims so um, the mentions of Barbie and the Barbie references and the Barbie uh, art artistry that's also kind of like a little uh, to me but like overall I love the concept of this pack um it says you can use MC command center to promote your sim from a computer in game um you can also use the UI cheats extension as well um if you don't want to complete the objectives it's super duper easy just to you know uh promote or demote your sim to pause a level and keep your current job title if you have MC command center you can freeze the career under sim flags. I recommend you use this as the careers are separated into categories, but one does not flow into the other, so traditional promotions won't be realistic. However, you can play through them if you like, trying different job titles for your sim. So again, as I've mentioned earlier, there are 10 branches and over 80 jobs. There are just way too many titles to list, but you can see most of the careers I decided to include here. You'll work on a few different skills, but if you don't want to do this, you can just right click them in the career panel to complete them if you have the UI cheats extension mod install the objectives are different from each career and although you'll be promoted if you don't use the for the freeze career tag they are not intended to flow one into the other I was hoping that there was going to be a mention on what to do when your sim is stuck in a branch and they want to try something else but unfortunately there is not um so as I kind of already expected the promotions are not meant to flow into each other they're going to be all over the place they're going to be random yada 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 um for some people this might not 
not be like something that you'd be interested in. But for me, for like storytelling purposes or just to try out something new, um, I love career packs. And so I wanted to share this with you. Anyways, you guys, if you're interested in picking up this bundle, I will link it in the description down below. And with that said, you guys, I hope that you all enjoyed this video. And if you did, you know what to do, boo. Don't forget to go ahead, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Where the sun does not shine. And I will see you all next time. Bye, guys. I saw you for a second and I'm happy that you came my way. Don't want to waste no time without you ever burning up my days. Never meant to fall so hard.